My name is Amar Jyot Singh, and I'm here to present to you a recent update on the express entry and the thrust for francophone immigration into Canada. The Minister of Immigration wants more French-speaking people outside Quebec to live here, and they have a certain quota system. Uh, they want more French people, uh, French-speaking people, sorry, to come and live outside uh, Quebec through express entry, and that's, that's the reason why they have increased the number of points uh, for express entry people who can prove that they speak French. The change announced today will see the current number of points increase from 15 to 25 for French speaking candidates and from 30 to 50 for bilingual candidates. So that is, of course, is a great jump. If you have English and as well take the French language test, you can see the scores as much as 50 uh, all the way through to get you express entry. So this is a great news. There are more uh, benefits for French speaking people if they want to get a job offer and they don't have to go through LMIA. So that's another advantage that you can uh, you know, take if you speak French. And I've uh, mentioned this uh, many years, uh, even in the past two years uh, to, to some people this, and I said, look, even if you have no skills, if you have no education, uh, no money, nothing, only thing that you want to do to come to Canada is start learning French. If you can learn adequate French, it will open the uh, doors to you through you know, work permit. Seeing on the screen, higher French speaking bilingual workers outside Quebec. The Canadian government is asking the Canadian companies and employers to recruit people who speak French from different countries, which are Francophone countries. For example, I'll show you some names here. Here it is France, Belgium, Morocco, Tunisia, Algeria, Ivory Coast, Cameroon, Mauritius, Mexico, and more. Uh, and they, in fact, the Canadian visa office in Paris, in fact, helps people, helps uh, the companies in Canada find bilingual candidates or francophone candidates from these countries and other, so that they can they can get to work outside Quebec and come to live in uh, in Canada. So francophone uh, uh, express entry, francophone immigration and express entry, your points will go all the way up. If you have NCLC seven, I'll show you what that score is you can get 50 additional points if you have English as well. But if you have CLB4 or lower in English, uh, then you get uh, at least uh, 25 points. So that's a big jump from, uh, we'll see an example how, how it goes. Uh, let's take an example of express entry. Let me just show a little bigger here if you can see this, yeah, here you go. So this is a comprehensive ranking uh, system tool. Uh, and a typical example of somebody who's a married, uh, who is, uh, let's say, 40 years old, master's degree, as many people have master's degree, IELTS, triple seven, eight, uh, and the French uh, score is, is this. So what is the French language score? Let me just show you if I have it on the screen somewhere. Here it is. So this is the, this is the uh, points for the language testing in Express Entry. So you need, uh, the points are here. So this is TEF Canada and NCLC number seven, which was shown on the first screen. So this is the score that you need to get. Earlier, they were giving only about uh, 16 points and now it is all the way you're looking at, you know, 50. So uh, come jumping back to it, 50 points here. And let's go back to our screen on the CRS tool. This, these are the points that we got for additional language skills in French beside English. And uh, how much experience do we have? Three years, of course, three years experience, that's the max. And the spouse has bachelor's degree and IELTS six. So how much score can we get? Uh, among all this, we get 469 score. That's a big uh, improvement. I mean, if you, if you did not have uh, French, you were possibly around 420 or 425 or so. Now, uh, it's because of uh, the age is 40. Uh, for example, let me do the age as, let's say 37, let's do 37. If I'm 37 and if I rest of the things are just uh, pretty much uh, constant, then uh, what is my score based on my additional French? Uh, it's 484. It's uh, way up, way above than uh, the current 471. So this is a uh, observation about the French. Please learn French. If you have French, if you, if you know, I mean, basically English and French both, not just French alone. If you have English and French both, it maximizes your chances, no matter, even though your age is 37. Now imagine if your age was, uh, let's put it as 34, let's put it at 34. Let's, let's see what happens then. So of course, uh, you know, look at the advantage that we are looking at here. So 499. 
there's no way that you will be able to miss express entry with this kind of score. So that's what you need to do. Uh, we already talked about the language. This is a score that you need. Uh, there's one other advantage uh, that if you, even if you have less score, for example, based on the age, you can go to Ontario Express Entry French Speaking Skill Worker Stream. In Ontario, if you speak, uh, if you can take the test of French, that's NCLC7. And if you have the Express Entry profile, then you will be invited for PNP. At what points? They're showing as, uh, where's that? Here it is even at the point system of 424 and 436. Take a look. And in the example that we saw that your points will automatically go beyond 480. So there's, there's no way that you will be able to miss Ontario if you, if you don't you know, care where you live. I mean, maybe you can go to live in Ontario. So that's where it is. Now, where do we learn French? How do we learn French? My favorite uh, organization is Alliance of France. This is, I'm showing in India. And uh, there are many centers all over the country. Gosh, there's a big list here. You can see the see this list, and um, pretty much go and uh, study study anywhere. You know, uh, there's no reason not to. Uh, if you want to come to Canada, I got to start learning French. That's all I had to say. Uh, thank you very much for listening and tuning in. If you have any questions about the scoring system of French or any other question related to Express Entry, please leave a comment, or else better. Uh, make a consultation, then I can look at your questions and then find out the answer. If I do not know the answer, I will research and find out the answer. I'm not an encyclopedia, but uh, I will take time to research and find out the accurate answer. Hey, thank you very much and uh, take care and uh, have a good day.